Hi everyone, it's Vicki. Welcome to my channel. And today I have a, where is it showing? <laughs> a stitch fix. And it is box one of three. It is the battle of the boxes. Yes, I have a stitch fix. I have a fashion and then I had a DNCO show up today. So really poor timing on my part. Um, I kind of delayed some boxes and somehow ended up with them all at the same time. That's a rat terrier nosing around. This room, I've tried to clean it where you can't see it, is a disaster because it is Christmas central in this room. And I have a dog getting into it. It sounds like wrapping paper, the uh, cardboard tube in the middle of it. But anyway, you don't care about that. Let's see what is in the Stitch Fix box and let's see what is going to end up on the hangers and what is going to end up in the bag. Now I have already tried these clothes on so that I could maybe reduce the time on my videos just a little bit. Everybody, oh sorry, everybody's busy at Christmas. You don't have time to watch me all day. So let's take a look at item number one. Edward. <laughs> First item is by Sashi. Guess that's how you say it. And it is a bracelet, from my understanding. So, really doesn't. I don't want to. I don't know if I can even get it out of there. It's taped in. Uh, yeah. I don't want to pull on it too hard, and I don't really want to untape it because I know I'm not going to keep it. I wear this bracelet like every day here, and this is. Um, like a little crystally diamond looking bar bracelet and I think I just prefer the one that I wear every day and part of it is a gift from my husband but um, so I don't really need this I don't really usually buy jewelry out of these boxes if I were to buy anything it'd probably be earrings but uh, so this is definitely going in the bag. Oh, and I should tell you about it. <laughs> it's the Sashi uh, Jilly Bezel Bar Bracelet in Gold for $56. Yeah, I'm going to save my $56 and wear my own bracelet, as I do almost every day. <laughs> All right, next is a top by Love Appella. And it's got a pretty floral pattern, pretty crocheted sleeve. And it says it is the Atherton Lace Sleeve Knit Top in black, size 3X, Um, too clingy around the middle yeah and it was kind of tight at the hips yet I think that's because I had on those trousers with it so that may have been the reason but it's definitely going in the bag all right next two items I tried on together and that is the Liverpool trouser and let's see what it says about them the Liverpool Renee straight leg pant in black, 18W, $88. I think I had these before in 20 and they were too big. Um, they fit very well in most places, but they had that bunching at the knee. I don't know what causes that. Tell me if you know what it is. They fit good in the thighs and they weren't even 
tight in the knees that I could tell, but I don't know if it, I started saying this, they're long, they hit my foot and bunch up, but I don't think so because they weren't that long. They felt really, really good, and I wish they didn't have that bunching in the knee. They had a little bit of the crotch drop, but it wasn't that bad. Um, it was definitely a livable amount, but they just, I guess these pants just aren't cut right for me, but they are very nicely made and very comfortable to put on. So, a little disappointing. All right, but moving on got three boxes so I'm not gonna cry over trousers that don't fit right all right next is a button-up top it's got a long asymmetrical top I do like the fabric it is some sort of natural cotton you know what I didn't tell you the fabric on the other two on the other did I well the trousers you can guess or I don't know what they are Let's see if it tells me easily. Sometimes trousers, I have a hard time finding it in there. Oh, there it is. The trousers are made in China, 57% rayon, 34% nylon, 9% spandex. Very nice fabric. All right, this is the one I really wanted to tell you. Because the pants, you just don't get as many choices. Let's see what this was. This is 95 rayon, 5% spandex. It's pretty light and a little clingy. I think that's one of the reasons it was a little clingy is because it is pretty lightweight. So back into the bag for you and back into the bag for you. <laughs> Not you. The pants. <laughs> uh, I'll just have to do that a little bit of that in a minute. All right, this top, like I was saying, when I first saw it, I thought this had a lot of potential. I like the fabric. It is 97 viscose, 3% spandex. It doesn't feel like it has spandex at all, actually. And, uh, but it, I think for my torso, it's just a little bit long. Uh, it's my favorite item in the box. However, I don't know if I have any pants that it would look good with. Just because of how long it is, it throws off the proportion of my whole body, I think. Yeah, if it were a little shorter, maybe. But I do like it. And if you're a longer torso person, this might work. It's got the buttons, did I say that already? and a button at the sleeve, and just to give you a good close-up of the pattern. Nice neutral colors, and uh, it's very nice though. I like it, but I don't think it was the right proportion for me. The last item is the dress. Did I say what the, no I didn't, I'm sorry. This dress, or, I'm sorry, the uh, Magnolia Grace Layman Asymmetrical Hem Black Top in 2X for $58. Again, my favorite item in there, uh, in the box, but I'm going to send it back because I think it, the proportions off for me it needed to be, I think because I'm short-waisted, it just was a little too long. But some people like, like my mother likes really long stuff, but the difference in the, the long and short was pretty severe for me. Okay. So the last item left in here is a Leota Criselda knit dress. And uh, this is a weird fit dress for me. First off, when I very first saw the pattern, I think in the checkout or something, I thought, I don't like it. But actually, I thought the colors looked good on me. Even though it has purple, it's all navy blue. I thought it was the coloring was pretty flattering. Um, but what I found was when I wore it, with the tag in the back it came way down in the back and the front neckline was pretty high and then way down in the back way more down than i would want to wear and it made it to where you could see bra straps a little so i turned it around and in the try on i was wearing it backward <laughs>
but um, really the problem with this dress is that the waist falls well below my waist and using this to cinch it up it doesn't stay. I don't know if you could tell in the try on but I did pull it up and it just falls right back down. It feels really good. It's soft and um, you know somewhat flowy for a knit dress. It is 95 poly, 5% spandex. But I did like things about it. But uh, yeah, it, it doesn't fit right at all. It just was slipping, sliding around on me. So into the bag, which means that everything is going back. Did I say the price of the dress? It, it's a size 3X and $88. Um, the total on this box was $338. A buy all discount would give me a 25% discount of $84.50. So the whole box would be $253.50 for a dress, <clears throat> two tops, a pair of trousers, and a bracelet. But sadly, it's all going back. So I have an empty hanger. But I do want to thank my stylist because they are... Um, when I look at these items right off, I got excited about them. I thought they looked pretty good. And for a moment there, I thought, oh, this might, except for the bracelet, would have been a five for five box. But the fit wasn't quite right for me. So anyway, on to the next box. Be sure to look for my video in a couple days, hopefully. <laughs> Thanks for watching my channel. I do hope that you will like and subscribe if you haven't uh, subscribed already. Happy holidays.